nice group of bulls. Cool thing about these Western Angus bulls, they're almost three. Uh, they're virgin bulls. I bought them as two and a half year olds. Hey, been turning out here in grass. Hey, they'll be three this fall, I guess, sir. Hey, bulls are, and they come from Lesker Angus, although they're, but they're old genetics. These bulls don't stay like this or get fatter when they're working. I don't have them on much country at all. Just dry as pasture. They haven't been in the feed yard somewhere getting fat. They're going to milk. These bulls already have their adult teeth. They're not little baby teeth bulls going to fall off in the pasture. I'll go through the numbers real fast. I can put them out there better lighting. So, uh, bulls are ready to roll. Oh, hey, walk him down. 105, 105. Well, hey. He's out of OCC broadside, OCC oldie. It's an oldie bull, okay? 105. Next bull is 106. He's in Blaze, Lesker and Blazon, son. Out of a new design cow. 107. Lesker and Blazon as well, again. Now the Summit Crest cow. Hey. Again, I could put them in light, better lighting out there. But they're nice Angus bulls. They're not going to fall apart. And again, the resale value on these is good. When you get them, when you get through using them, put some weight back on there. It'll be easy to flip. 100 is uh, OCC Paxton. Oh, Paxton, son. Where's it? I have a Bando cow. OCC Paxton. I have a Bando cow. Again, four nice Angus bulls ready to work. These dudes have not been pampered on a dry ass grass pasture. It, it's most of the pasture is weed, so and no creep, nothing. And hang up the donkey and 20 other bulls fighting for food, so fighting for grass. So, bulls ready to cover lots of ladies. Call me.